yes, this is the first game, Suomi versus Vietnam Legends and check because it's also a little surprise before we get inside. What? Well, it's super fast, but you're gonna notice really cool. There you go, guys, that beautiful transition, beautiful transition. The transition has been done by Mr. Borbagon and a really nice job like always. And you can see yellow, Viles, blue, Supi and Teal the Max. The Max Persians is facing who? Purple, Portuguese. I like it, man. Portuguese, Magyars and Korea. Honestly, the civilization choice. And remember, if you are watching this or if you play on Bubbly, now if you press the shift, you know, you can change directly point of view. You know? Yeah, man. Fantastic. Okay. Max. ACCM. Beautiful. Well, if you put the Fog of War, you can see that in this one, in this one, in Coliseum, this fantastic map, yeah, man, is it's in another level. Why? The wood is all around the edge of the map. And all the action will happen really early, but we have seen many games with action all the time. With action really, really all the time. And honestly, Koreans really dangerous to be flying. And also getting the cartography in this map can be really important. Then we have Bakti Pocket Magyars. It's just fantastic matchup. But Biles got Mayans. Mayans are always, always really strong. And uh, let's see what how he's gonna deal. Oh man, he's laming three goats. Three goats already. Three goats already. The middle Ethiopian's pocket is not the best, but in this map can be good. You can see now the mics already taking the elephant. Tell me if, if everything is good. Pocket in Age of Empires means that you are in the middle and flanks. You see? Uh oh. Okay, he didn't kill. I thought that maybe he could kill it, but no, he saved it. And now, ooh, those four ships, man. Four goats. Got it. Err, uh, restart from Supi in the last second. Ay, ay, ay. Let's go back. Now, guys, Suomi versus Vietnam Legends. First game after the restart from Suomi, remember? So, guys, come on. Let's go, guys. Let's go. This is Battle of Africa. Yeah, man, well, Battle of Africa is starting. You can see now blue Ethiopians facing now Koreans. Say my name. The pocket is Mayans, Vilas, and now Persians is the flank. Honestly, I don't know why they did the restart, but I don't think so. The restart is working. Oh, my goodness. It's the same, and they have used the restart already. That's absolutely crazy. Okay. And you can see how gray Koreans say my name. He's facing Supi. Stone in front, Braves at the back, Go at the back, Sebras at the back. Look at the elephant. Well, most of the resources at the back is the ideal in this map. Why? Because like I said before the restart, look at the middle, guys. All completely bye-bye. Oh, I forgot to put King of the Desert Terrain. But honestly, I like this one. Not gonna change. Not gonna change. I think this is okay, and I don't have to change all the time. I'm used to these graphics. Hopefully the terrain is, is good, and it's okay for everyone. Maybe the other is better? Well, it's possible. Because the palm trees... Eh, I will change maybe later. <laughs> it's true, I don't know. Anyway, this uh, civilization choice, I still think that if they play aggressive, Vietnam... Oh, man! The eagle! The eagle is going to the damn hell! Four minutes and one second. Are they going to restart now? Because when there is a pause like this, it means that the host time is in four minutes. And it can be really a restart. We will see, guys. We will see. Well, I don't know, man. What is going to happen? Well, maybe it's back to pause. But the eagle... Okay, he saved it, the eagle in the last second. The problem now for Biles, I'm going to his point of view, is that, yeah, now he can't lay me with, he can lay an elephant with the eagle with half HP, you see? All right, 
He's the pocket man. He's the pocket trying to... Oh, and Bakhti also with the... Going to the flank. You can see how pockets are playing really aggressive. And I, I still insist. Look at this one. Bakhti point of view, Fog of War. Knowing in this map what they are doing that early. It, oh, damn it. Damn it. All these details can delay you, man. All these details can delay you. And he's going again. He has the loom, but uh, he has to be really careful. Let's check. Okay. I don't know. Oh, it was a pause. It was just a pause. They keep playing. Wood at the back. Of course, always Wood is at the back. With three villages here, four incoming, four already. And, uh, wow. Well, this matchup, remember, really important. They are 1 1 in the Swiss system. It means that they won one series each. And today, they will be really close to advance for the semi finals. But the other one will still have to win the last two weeks in a row. That's always dangerous. Always really, really dangerous. Because, yeah, man. It's gonna be really difficult. Anyway, now, what is this? Okay. What? That is his elephant! He's laming his, he's laming his teammate! Bakhti is taking the elephant from his teammate! Bakhti is laming now! Say my name! Say my name! With one elephant less because Bakhti is laming his own partner! Unbelievable! Let me, let me relax! But he is laming his own teammate! Yes! He lame it! Okay? Lamer boy in his team! Now, Korea's factor, we will see! We will see, he took his elephant, Titanic, Mem F4, really, unbelievable really, and now he's gonna eat the Tom Center, no, okay, let's see, he will have the food, gonna be really, no man, he don't have now the food, unbelievable, unbelievable Bakhti, taking three damn elephants, ay ay ay, ay 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 ay, that's really really good for Bakhti, taking the elephant man, Okay, we will see, guys. We will see. And of course, Supi with two elephants. Now you can see that... Uh, oh, he's lame in the stone. Beautiful, beautiful. Lame in the stone. Let's go to Supi point of view. He's laming his stone. This is very, very strong. He sent a villager and not letting him the, the tower rush. He's gonna now explore what? Another stone. And if he's going to this one... If he's going to this one, let's see if he's gonna go, if he's gonna go, ay ay ay, oh visible, look at this, one, two tiles, one, two, oh my goodness, he's trying to come, he's trying to come, he's on the way to Philly, but he's walling, he's walling, he can't wall anymore, alright, alright, well, it's not gonna be really effective, he need to go with the scout as well and fight, but he has the stone at the back, only one stone, is still going forward, Still going forward, 9 minutes 41 seconds with 20 population, it's not great time. It's really, well, it's okay. But his economy now, let's go and check what economy he has. Look at the food he has. 2 billies on berries with 100 food. And now going forward to the pocket. 4 billies, 5 billies, that's gonna be very dangerous. Billes is going up slow, or slower better say than say my name. And this is going to be absolutely epic. Epic! Okay, he needs to be careful, both stoned here, so Supi has wasted a little bit. Wasted a little bit because, yeah, he still can't take a stone. And he's going to the max. He's going to the max and Portuguese with Grey as well on max spot. Where he's gonna make the bar right at the back, I like it. This is gonna be super intense, towering coming on his main goal. And the max goal in this spot. To be careful, the tower is, is happening. And let's check the Mike's point of view what he can do now. Fog of War, the tower is happening. And mining goal now. Yes, the Max. The Max can see already the tower. The Max can see already the tower. And just need to go back. The good thing is Persian has good economy. And now minus stone. He's going to stable. All right. And let's see what the Max is going to do. He's sending a spear. No, not a spear. And the scout for the Max is going to be bye-bye. Wow. The Max, a little bit of Titanic. He's putting a tower here. I don't know if this is a good one. But he's now need to minus stone and wall. He's walling right now. 
the Max usually is a good player defending against this. And yeah, he's now palisading. Remember that his economy is really not great. Gray is with weak, really weak economy. In this situation, I don't know if a scout is a good idea. Even if he's, uh, yeah, archie range. I will go archie ranges. Even if he's Persian, really. Now he's one a wall, sending the spear, and the tower is already up there, so he's protecting this tower. But he can make another around. Well, we will see. They are expecting this double archie range at home. He's going with a stable, I believe. Where is the, where is orange, buildings? What is he doing? The scouts, but they don't find the stable. Okay, here it is. And those are beautiful scouts with forging. He's now doing a tower here. He's gonna make... No! This is a panic tower? I think so. Mm, I'm not sure. He need to mine a stone as well. Trying to make the damage, but honestly, he's not taking so much damage with those towers. Let's see blue. I believe that blue can make a lot of damage with spears and archers. We will see. If three players with... Do, two with double archer range and the other one with the stable look at the tower already and now okay let's see oh, he's with the tower and 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 now he need to go back a little bit and Mayans is a good good civilization to get good economy he need to, to mine a stone and the problem is that if he's going to the wood that's gonna be a problem a big problem as really uh oh uh oh Oof. This tower, man, I told you that I didn't like so much that one. Is the Max now? Yeah, Max has a stone already, but he can see also this tower, man. What is the Max doing then? I don't understand, really. I mean, he has a stone, and now he can't take a stone anymore. I don't understand why he's mining a stone. He did a tower here, just mine that stone now, and let's see if he can defend. Anyway, not big damage, but now back to trying to raid, going aggressive on Beles. Blue, it's really, really important. Ooh, it's really important that he has fletching. No, but he has few, few arches here on the wood. He need the fletching. He's now going to make a tower, but, 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 but. Yeah, there you go. No fletching, no nothing. No fletching, no nothing. Good tower. They are playing good, Vietnam. They are playing good. Let's see at home if they are going to be palisade. Yes, all the wood is palisade. He's now coming with more scouts. Do you need more spears or he will lose? And he has archers, spears. To follow all the action is really difficult, guys. Really complicated. You can see purple sending the archers and yellow, not a tower there. Oh man, let's go to Biles. Biles has now a stone to make one tower. When he's gonna make it? Where he's gonna make it in this in the on the wood? He's gonna lose a villager or not? Oh my goodness! Oh, that tower is bad. Tower must must be here. Why? Because the other guy can still make some tower close and make the damage in your wood. Here the tower is ideal, in my opinion at least. Many scouts now trying to raid. More and more, but in the other spot, yeah man, Blue Soupy is doing the job. He's doing the job trying to disturb them. Double stable. Back to double stable? What? It's, it's maybe too much. I don't know. He doesn't have the farms to, to produce a scout with double stable, but it can be interesting playing that aggressive. Now he is. He's trying to raid and raid and say my name. Really predictable this. And now you can see yellow with so many archers doing the job. Fletching activated is fantastic. Those villains. You can see the multitasking. And the max doing more and more towers. Uh, all right. Defending with the towers, the max might be able to get a very good economy. He's with Persians. And Persians will know how good they are in terms of economy. Now, going to the other side, you can see, ooh, those scouts will kill everything. Just use the spears, use the spears properly, but those scouts gonna kill all, gonna kill all. Well, back to doing something really good. He's just doing a lot of farming. Ooh, stop it in the TC. Yeah, but he need more spears, definitely. He's trying to make a lot of scouts because Gray has no army. And Gray is in troubles, 54 population. Now the archers with plus one, plus one, and they are Ethiopians hitting 18% faster, so that's a problem. Arch is coming on the right side. And tower from Supi. Well, the towers, tower rise is, it can be really dangerous, but it became a little bit predictable. A little bit predictable. Oh, he's losing a couple of villages. I still think that the Max could have done maybe an archie range. Oh, well, he's trying to go as fast as possible, Castellage. And he will. Look at his resources, guys. Now, if we go to Supi point of view, you can see that with the market he has already... Ooh, 
Oh, 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 gonna lose a couple of villages or maybe more. Aye, aye, aye. The spears, where are the spears? Where are the spears, man? One village down. He's now with the multitasking getting problems. Two villages down. No, he lost only one village and walled. All right. Yeah, back to East, playing damn aggressive. Look at the score. Now he is with so many scouts, skill bar in armor. And the score now, it's going up for Vietnam. But Yellow, Mr. Yellow, it's Viles, is going with so many archers. And now he's gonna make a lot of damage in those stone miners. Ay, 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 he's de getting there. He's getting there, one village down. Let's see. He's gonna kill villains or not. One, two, three. Four, what a disaster! And say my name didn't notice, man! Look at the amount of villains he's losing! La, 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 la. How many villains he killed? Many villains! 33 population! But this... He need help here, the Max. He need help here. And if he's going back, this is so many arches. I will go to the goal, get in that spot, close to the goal miners, and he can't do the job. You see, he's doing exactly that. A little bit stuck, so then he cannot kill like this. Even if he's killing, because he's gonna kill probably all the archers, or maybe not. Wow, it's so many archers. Ooh, ACCM is coming. Bilas, coinage. Coinage to the max. I'm going to switch to max point of view. He's on the way to Castle Age. Yes, and I'm sure that he will sling the max. Whoa, 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 whoa. This sling is working here? It's unbelievable, the map is super open, but now the max has not many resources, so if he sling him, he can make with Persians crazy damage. Double stable, bloodlines, all the stuff, and blue, this is really crucial, Supi, it's on the way to Castellage. On the way to Castellage. Wow, oh, he overchopped! In the last damn second, man! In the last damn second, Sans got he has a tower, but man, Bilas, he he's doing these kind of mistakes really often, man. Ay ay ay! You have to be careful, Bilas. Well, the tower is helping, but look, Bilas could be in an amazing situation, and now he overchop and get inside. Oh man, Warrant! Thank you so much for the subscription, but he's losing a lot, a lot of villains, Bilas. Come on, he has now less villiers, less villiers than say my name. What the hell? Look how many villiers he lost there. Unbelievable. It's crazy, really. Now he's doing a tone center. <clears throat> and let's see if he's gonna send some resources. Yeah, Bilas is still sending resources, but now in, in more problems. Here, blue soupy. We have a strong army. Pikes, remember Ethiopian's pike upgrade for free. And those crossbows will be really strong. But here, oh man, he's in trouble. He need to attack. He really need to attack. It's plus two. Oh, this is really unprotected, man. Completely unprotected. This is getting inside. Ay, ay, ay. The score is switching. The score is switching because they really had mis. They really did mistakes. Yeah, a lot of army supi. Lot of army supi. 68 population. If yellow didn't overchop here, they will be in a fantastic position right now problems the tower is there and with those knights he really he really will kill everything are the other the other slinging it's possible that he's slinging as well uh not really so let's go to uh oh he's going to go up he's going to go up so completely different strategies one team is going for the sling the other team it's going for castle age this flank but maybe it's not gonna be effective, or maybe yes, I don't know. But now the Max really need to kill fast. Ooh, ooh, he need to split the, the, the knight. He need to split the knight. He can make the damage on the gold miners. But if he's going to the other side, this is gonna be terrible. Okay, he's ready now. Finally, with 10 villains more, the Max, 10 villains more. Just go away. This is so many arches. He's trying to go now to the wood. He didn't go in all the game, I think. No, man, he almost didn't. Say my name now. Castle Age. And back to. Back is dangerous in these positions. He's okay with 41 villages, and let's see if he's gonna raid a lot. This link is still really, really activated, man. One, two, three tone centers, and the mass with three TCs and under his link might be able to dominate. Might be able to dominate. The problem is those towers that are going to be really annoying. But now he's ooh, stone miners, bye bye, and farmers. Yes, if we find those villages. He will, he will send three knights to one side. He's not sending. Okay. He's going now. He's walling a little bit, but the raiding is there. Just kill. 
it's really easy to, to kill. He's not taking, he's not doing damage. Okay, he's gonna get team or not? We will see, guys. We will see. It's gonna be really, really easy to break that. He's getting the ability. No, he's walling in the last second again. Okay, but if he's getting inside, he's killing some abilities. Now back is there with the knight. Let's put all visible. He need to move, but at least he's getting some idle time. The towers still doing the damage. As you can see, two towers and many scouts around. While in the other side, oh man, soup is going, soup is going, soup is going. This is this is game. This can be game. If soup is arriving and he's arriving in time, he's gonna make the castle. Now he can't. He can't make the castle. He's there with the archers, not letting him make the castle. Ay ay ay! And he's in time with ballistic and ladder archer armor. Yes, so many crossbows. At the back, you can see now ACCM and Bacti trying to go together against the Max. But the Max is still going for a super strong boom, 100 population and doing all the damn upgrades. If he gets all together here, he can make the damage. But they really need to make the damage. More damage on Say My Name. Say My Name, 44 villages is still behind in villages with Vilez. But Vilez. Feudal Age and now in troubles. He should make more towers and maybe add some spears. All those scouts might kill him completely. But if the Max and Supi are going strong to the next age, that's mean Imperial, it might be an oath. And maybe don't need. Ooh, Mangonel, Mangonel! Open formation! This is a beautiful and amazing fight going to happen. So many crossbows. Look at the amount of knights. So many crossbows also for ACCM. The Mangonel is coming. The Badaboo can happen. It didn't happen. That was a good micro from Supi. But you need to go all together with the Max. It's going to get all the army in the same spot. We will see. Remember, being the army split, it's crucial and can be a disaster for the future of the game. Yeah, the castle is going to be up and the war wagons might help a lot. The score difference is basically nothing. The max is damn it for that I still in his point of view. He is on the way to Imperial. On the way to Imperial. Yes. So the max now on the way to Imperial Cavalier 77 villages. He can dominate and kill everything. He's now with the rams trying to kill. Sorry, destroy those towers and going to destroy. But ACC um Guys, Portuguese on the way to Imperial, man. On the way to Imperial, is he getting any resources? 500 resources. And he's up to Imperial ACCM with 71 villages. That's pretty impressive. With seven villages behind that the Max, he's also on the way to Imperial, but he's gonna be with crossbows. Future Arbalest. Say my name, Coinage now. And the problem is clear. The Max has Persians. Many knights will be future cavaliers that has plus two extra against the crossbows. But now they are going to be alone. Lonely, lonely against Bhakti and the crossbows. He needs to go back. He has to be really careful. He's so many knights. But guys, this is two versus one. This is gonna be epic fight. Epic for sure. The mass need a castle maybe to protect but he can't for now. This is the second goal. Pretty, pretty exposed. He's gonna lose the ramp but he's just Waiting till Imperial. The Knights, future Cavaliers will do the damage. He has a lot of army, 44 army like you can see. And when he's doing the upgrade, ay ay ay, ay ay ay. Let's see blue. Blue, Supi might be, oh he's close there. Okay, he has great population. The game is just like most of the times in this map, fantastic. Cavaliers play Bard in armor. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's gonna take the fight now. Don't take it, man. Don't take it. Ah, yeah, yeah. Well, he's taking the fight here, which is not a good idea because he's taking the fight before doing the upgrades. What are you doing? The max. Now he's coming with the crossbows. He need to go now. And really, those knights. Okay, crossbows are just there. Plus four. He's waiting the upgrades. He's waiting the upgrades. Played Bard in armor. Cavalier. And now what is going to happen? What is going to happen? Ay, ay, ay. Cavaliers played Bard in armor. Plus two, plus two. Yes, he's gonna be there. He has the plus four now. He has the plus four now. The armor is not, he, he can't really dominate. He can't really dominate. Killing the crossbows, perfect micro, perfect momentum. And now with the Cavaliers, there you go. The fight is going to happen. Who is gonna take this one? Well, I believe Finland will take it. The score, the score is still pretty, pretty close. And Biles is doing an amazing game, beginning feudalists with the same population. Then, then say my name. Look at the Cavaliers, there you go. He's gonna kill all. We will see what is Supi doing. This is a really bad, really, really, really bad fight for Finland. What Supi is doing, killing the houses, ay, ay, ay. The Cavaliers are going to dominate. I don't, 
I don't know, but I think the Max did a really bad attack. Really bad attack. Because Supi wasn't there. And now he will have plus four, plus four. He lost most of the Cavaliers. He's coming with more. But the Chronos now from Supi are bye bye. And I'm telling you that Vietnam can take this game. Vietnam with ACCM in a crazy, crazy, crazy performance. 60! 60 Arbales! He's doing an amazing job. Now the Max Paladin Blast Furnens. Paladins, it's the way to go, but Blue doing a castle is just an amazing situation right now. Supi 90 villages, 90 villages up to Imperial. Still, the max is the max. He has 130 population, but purple, a lot of farmless. In the right side, you can see Supi castle in front with so many crossbows as well. Not, not really, 20 army only. Vietnam got more army. For that reason, they are ahead. Are they gonna be able to make damage on their economy? He's not done any damage on his economy. Now he's gonna kill some villages. There you go. There you go. And they really need to do the damage or they won't win the game. Now he's trying to raid, trying to raid say my name. We will see. Back to Imperial H2. Imperial H2. And what is Gray doing? Well, 68 population only, doing some resources, this is like 2v2 actually, like 2v2, but one player is in Castle, the other is in Feudalist. The raiding now finally is happening, he's gonna get inside, if he's gonna be able to get in and raid, then everything gonna change. The Max usually is really good in this in this kind of situations, we saw some bad misplay there, but now with, with Supi in Imperial, Arbalest and Halves, he should be able to push here, and honestly, the Paladin should do the job. ACCM is still playing not good. No, 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 no. Amazing. I mean, if he's now ra getting raided and he's losing a lot of villages, a lot of villages, the game is still really damn close. Oh, but he's taking more. Look at those paladins. Gonna take some knights, gonna take some villages as well. And raiding, but defending properly. Well, properly, say my name, 59 population. They need to kill this. If they kill this one, then big problems. And blue is doing another cast along his face and with trebuchet and arbalest might be able to push on orange when they push on orange then the max will take it and the max now with 136 population and whoa look at his ratio kills that really really low in comparison what he should yeah 60 76 91 still negative ratio kills that which is in incredible incredible really back the more than double man or double the unit kills lost, but now those paladins is the way to go. The paladins who kill now everything. 50 paladins from the max. Look at those. I mean, if he's alone, those paladins really will take everything. He's trying to convert with the monks, yes, but then blue, blue is coming from behind. Blue is coming from behind. The sandwich is gonna be real. He's trying to kill the monks, and with those paladins and armorless, I, I, I feel that he's coming back from the hell. What a game! Pure of action from minute 10, and now they are killing everything. Population is going dramatically down, and Supi with Trebuchet is gonna kill Grey. This is awesome. This is absolutely fantastic, and it's getting closer and closer to big game. Whoa, they kill everything. Where are the archers? Where are the archers from ACCN? Because I don't see them anymore. All the Paladins, Arbalest, taking absolutely everything, and the rating here is just brutal. Brutal rating on. Say my name with 63 population, Bacti now gonna be with Cavaliers while the Mask got 50 Paladins. Doing a castle that is not gonna be up. Okay, Paladins for Bacti, but it's late. I think Finland at the end it's winning the game. Yeah, look at the score, how it explode. This is the 1-0 guys. A fantastic, fantastic, aggressive game. I love this map. I really love this map. Not that I cast this map so many times because I get pretty, pretty tired after a while because it's always full of action. Whoa! Well, this castle is now down. ACCM with 126. He's still going with, with Arbalest. He should go with Halves because, yeah, you, after a while, you, it's impossible that the Paladins can be stopped by Arbalest. The Paladin has great bonus with Persians against those archers and now he's raiding absolutely everything. Yeah, he's pushing, this is Arbalest all together and the rating is real, so he's rating everything. Population is going dramatically down, the score difference will be like 2000 and well, we can check yellow also. He has his feudal age, he can go now 
up to Castellate. No, he's sending all the resources to the Max. He got really strong resources and the Max. Yeah, look at the Max resources now. I think Yellow could go now. He is on the way to Castellate, like you can see. So, yeah, man, great performance. Great, 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 great performance in this one. Wow, perfect execution by Finland. He's ready, getting ready. Say my name is slinging to, to Bakti, but Bakti now, well, he got now Paladins, all right. He has to be careful now with those. He need to make helps, and he's with the help of the ears, within the castle. Arbol is behind the, the castle, and if he's sending all the Paladins, they will kill everything to Bakti now. Yeah, Bakti has good Paladins now. 28 Paladins, 109 Villiers, but 76. The problem is that now Purple can't do anything anymore. He was doing a really good job, but you can see, so many Paladins together with Treps and Arbalest are going to push on Bakti and 70 population say my name. So this link he can make is not great, you know? And the advantage is really there for Finland in this spot. While if we switch a little bit fast to... Yeah, look at this. This is the point of view from ACCM. He got all the gold, but no food, no wood, no nothing. Absolutely nothing. The team, the teamwork here was fantastic for Finland. I'm gonna switch again to the max. You can see the max, 170 population with 3,000 score difference. And look at now the radio kills that. 200 unit kills, 133. They are not calling the GG, but now I can go calm down a little bit because this seems to be over. It seems to be over, all right. Okay, Castle up, taking down all those villagers. He's hitting all the map. 67 Paladins. Well, they have army. They really have army, but uh, yeah, but they are ready now. all. Whoa, whoa, this is a total massacre. Massacre in the north, killing all the villagers. This is total domination. I'm gonna be the one zero as soon as they call it, because right now they can't do anything. Yellow is doing an amazing job now. <laughs> well, in all the map, you see, but he still have 84 population and this is the GG call. GG call, beautiful game. I really love those one. This is the one Cito and definitely team strategy dominated in this one. Achievements, achievements military. You can see the max at the end, 228 unit kills. They got some problems for a while, but at the end, even with ACCM, 87 largest army, the max and super combination dominated with the less giving giving guys 15,000 resources 15,000 resources say my name 6,000 even with banking village with coinage 15,000 that was amazing really and the max of course faster in cast in castle age faster in imperial age and you can see in the timeline how he took some beautiful acts here and also together with supi and got the game this is guys battle of africa first game guys choose first game of the day now guys, Suomi Vietnam Legends, second game after the first super aggressive game, and it's going to be what, Arabia, vamos amigos, vamos, vamos amigos, if it's working, oh, there you go, there you go guys, this is Arabia, Hans, Indians and Malians, Incas, Franks and Berbers, whoa, Epic and beautiful civilizations, really, really, really strong civilizations. And I'm gonna check really soon because I got a problem, but it's gonna be fixed really fast. Yes. Well, pocket. The Max Indians, guys. The Max Indians pocket. I don't want to say anything else, but the Max Indians pocket against Incas ACCM pocket. They will be a restart? Probably. Berbers on a flank. And the other flank, Franks say my name. Don't wait till four minutes. You will call a restart. And if you don't call a restart, you will have to play incredibly aggressive. Incredibly aggressive. Wow. Oh man, oh man. Let's see guys. In when the, you see the hose in four minutes? If there's a little pause. Mm, well. It has been no not really but honestly if they want to make a restart don't wait till the last second because the other team already use it anyway indians versus incas is i don't know but it's really bad nah uh, it's restart man just call a restart man 
Why, why you waste time? Look, it's a restart, guys. But why they waste time like this? I mean, I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Why they waste time and don't call a restart? Imagine that now they fail. Ah, he will call a restart. It's obvious. But let me extend the bettings. If they don't call a restart, it's game over. But why they wait till the last second? Yeah, they did. They wait till the last second. It's a stupid. But well, it's their choice. This is now the second game. So Omi versus Vietnam. Go, go, go. And it's gonna be what? It's gonna be. Well, guys, Bambos, it's Arabia. And like I told you, now we have the Masters of Flying facing Frank Say My Name. Now Pocket is Berbers. Perfect. Perfect now for Bacti. And Malian's Pocket is good too. Then Hans is Flank Supi versus Incas ACCM. Incas, very, very nice to be Flank. And well, good situation now for both teams. Of course, I prefer Indians as a pocket, but still, both India, I mean, all Indians, Malians and Hans with bloodlines, really a strong cavalry civilization, so as a pocket, no problems. And Berbers, probably the best choice to be pocket. Well, maybe even better is Franks, you know, because Berbers is probably, yeah, a little bit better as a flank. As a pocket, they will need a little bit more time to get all the strength with the camel archers, but. If you get there in that situation, it's just epic. It can be really, really epic. Because Berbers, they have good music, but also, well, good absolutely everything. Really, really everything. Yeah, they, they are really strong. Also, the cavalry are cheaper. So remember, that can be a good point. Say my name, gonna lame? No, not laming. Okay, go for the betting, guys. I will open one more minute for the bettings. Go, go, go. Oh, both elephants? Let me check. The Max, you can see it? Yeah, he can see both. And now he's laming something? No, oh, he's gonna take kill advantage. Okay, he's not taking. He's going around. Oh, but he, he laming the ships, the goats. That's crazy, really. Interesting. So he laid it to 200 foot, which is not great. The map for for Beles as a pocket is pretty nice. He has wood at the back on the right side, in front a big forest. Don't like those hills. Very in front, but he's a wall already. Oh, but that elephant! Thank you for oh come on, Mr. Buddha! Thank you so much, man. Six moons in a row. Amazing support. Okay. Well, we can check more civilizations, like for example. The beautiful Hans and Hans Supi has what map he has easy to palisade with two forests gonna block this he's gonna take those goats mm -hmm. problems and uh, the elephant let's see if now ACCM can see it he can see the elephant and he can lame it I'm gonna lame it man there you go right away taking the elephant I think he clicked only one time he might go back let's see if Supi now going to notice is he gonna notice? I think he will. Yeah. Oh, the elephant, you see? Instantly going back. Instantly going back. Ay ay ay. And now he's taking a gain. But he hit only one time, so it will go back again. Again and again and again. Ay ay ay. Oh, there you go. I told you, man. I told you, man. Trust me, man. Trust me. And go. And now Supi. It's an again. There you go. Oh my goodness. That lamey, man. That lamey is very good if I do it. But not for you, Mr. AZZM. Just hit the eagle, man. The eagle is really low HP. Kill the damn eagle. Are you gonna kill the eagle or not? Try to kill. Oh! Kill it, man. Okay, he's gonna stop for sure. No. Oh, that elephant. Oh my goodness, that elephant. What the fuck, man? It's still go. What? What is that elephant, man? Teleport? He's not stopping! Oh, oh, oh. He, oh, still going, man! The elephant, man! Almost going to the tone center! Are you for real? Oh, man! 
that elephant was was still going, man. It's crazy, really. And it still stopped. This is lazy elephant. He's really lazy. And it's still not going back. You gotta be kidding me, man. Now he's going back like he need a minute, man. Whoa. What an ass, this elephant. <laughs> anyway, let's focus now in the other spot. Anyone lost something? No. And back B. It's super fast up. Super fast up. Yeah, man, the elephant is coming back. But Supi has been a little bit delayed, but he's still up to fiddle its 22 population. Amazing. Really, really amazing. Yep. Well, you can see. Now Supi can go and take the elephant, so we'll have the food. What he will do with two, well, with two farmers and taking that elephant, he might be able to go scout. I believe so. Okay, let's see. Eagle coming, and, and, and. Oh, he's gonna go gold. So he's going for, for archers. Interesting. Gonna go archers. Then yellow, Vilez. Gonna be a little bit slower. One village behind. No! Two villages ahead to pack the. Yeah, because it's like 50 seconds. So he's going up fast, but way faster. Bacti. Let's see Bacti how he's gonna play as a pocket. He's really strong. He took the elephant now and uh, mining, mining camp. He's gonna wall something? Well, this is pretty open. Let's see. So pockets both scouts. As you can see, a scout for, for Bacti. Now he's coming, Supi, with the with the scout, trying to explore a little bit more. Yeah, he's gonna see how how that corner it is. Complicated to to wall all. He's now finishing the barrack, and he will make the double archery range in front. In top of that hill, a little bit slow, Mr. Supi. And double archery range as well. Yes, double archery range. Say my name too. Wow, not going to scouts. Then play safer. Yeah, it's safer to go like this when the pockets are also going to scout. Interesting. And what in all? Yes, he's one in everything. He need to wall this area too. Wow, this map I told you guys is good for for Belaz. It's really good. Let's see now. Oh, the men at arms. The men at arms. The men at arms. The men at arms. Ay ay ay. He's being really slow. He's gonna punish it or not? He's doing now the damage. A C C M. And he's finishing only one RG range. Not great, not great. Supi, a little bit slow. He's gonna palisade or not? What the hell? Okay, he's doing in the last second. Wait until the last second just to force me a heart attack. And now the gold miner is, is gonna palisade or not? He can palisade here, I don't know. There you go. Is this open? I think there is a little hole. I think there is a hole or not. No, this is three, and now with the archer he's fine. He's gonna make the second archer range, and Purple has already two archer ranges. He's coming with the scouts. He doesn't have a single spear, so the scout's gonna make the damage. It's a sloppy play by Supi. Definitely a sloppy play by Supi. Definitely a sloppy play by Supi. Billy is going to be down. Yes, man, but you are not playing properly, Supi. It's fully open map, and you are sending the village without any protection. No spears, no nothing. Not finishing those palisades, not finishing the archery range. And now, definitely ACCM, if he's playing properly, he should do the job. Let's see the teamwork, how important it's going to be. He should go aggressive. He's gonna make. He's doing already the blast so he would make the fletching, and this is a pause. Yellow, it's one in all the map. Yes, but he is still open in that area. He can see it. We will check right now if Belez can see it. Well, a house here. Oh, he's going. All right. But, like I told you. Okay, let me check. Yeah, this is fine. The game keeps going. And Supi is in troubles. Well, he's behind. 28 villages, but ACCM 28 villages as well. Hans are Hans. But now, BLS is there with the scout. Men at arms coming, and he needs to finish and palisade the front. He got a very nice map to do the job, but he's not doing right now. The scouts are coming, and uh, archers from the mics say my name too. And let's see, because the fletching is really important. Oh, there you go, man. Need to send the archers. It's many. Many scouts now from yellow. Well, orange? Yeah, there you go. He's completely walled. That's great for yellow. And those men at times are going to be bye-bye. 
Oh, but sent to the TC. Did he finish it? Yes, he did. Still not Polyside in front, and he need the Blastmate. Let me check that he has a plus one now. ACCM doesn't have the plus one. The scouts now there. 36 population BLS, 36 back beat. Let's see how strong both Pokes are going to play. This is really, really important. And Malians, remember, they have the gold mining upgrade for free. That's important because you need less villages or you're gonna get the gold faster. Whatever is similar. I'm gonna go to... Yeah, Supi point of view is still good amount of arches, but no fletching. ACCM with fletching. And not sending yet arches, 16 minutes. Maybe he should have sent already, I don't know. But he was in a good spot there to make the damage. Now Supi the same belly is, even if he lost one belly here. Yeah, okay, this is wall. I'm not sure if this is wall. Palisade gate, and the Palisade. And where's the blast man? Is he doing? Yes. Doing and gonna wall here. Well, this could be a team wall, if they explore properly, but he's trying to go to the middle. But, oh, that goal is exposed. That goal is exposed. I don't know if they see it. Let's go and check. Let's check Bill S point of view. No, he didn't explore back to yet. Back to is at 19 minutes, 17 seconds. Pretty crazy. Bill S 19 minutes, 40 seconds. Bill S now going to find the coal miners. There you go. He's gonna flare in instantly. You see, he's flaring and sending the arches. Oh my goodness, he's gonna make another stable. If he join, if he join in time, he's gonna make the damage. This is really, really, really important. He's now sending the arches. Let's see if the max is gonna be in time i switch to the max point of view he's going he's really really going ay 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 he's flaring where there no 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 he need to go the goal is there the no you see you see ay 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 he went to the left he went to the left where the gold miners are in the other spot oh my goodness now he's going but he's not the same let's see if bakti going to see this bakti point of view full of war he can't see the arches he if he put the arches there, he will delay him. Delay him. He, he can't see still. Oh my goodness, really? Come on, the Max. Come on, the Max. The Max. What? He went away, man. He went away. Ay, ay, ay. Well, he want to go to the to his spot, or he will. Ooh, say my name. On the way to Castle Age. On the way to Castle Age. This is starting to be epic. Really. Well, Vietnam seems to be a little bit faster in Castle Age, but the Max mistake, well, mistake. He could do the damage in the pocket, and now he's safe, completely safe. Really? Not the best choice there. The Max is up, it's lower like 40, 50 seconds, but five billions ahead. India's power, five billions ahead. Whoa! Now, in the other side, is two versus two. So, the Max and Say My Name in that spot. Yeah, they are going to fight. And let's see if they are going to send one or two knights. The pocket, the pocket decisions are crucial now. Because now it's not like a 4v4. The pocket need to choose one side. And if you can split or send some units, oh well, oh well. Plus one and Bloodlines. He's going with those... Scouts, he need to go back. This is many arches, but the knights are already there. He need to go back, but back is also here. So, Bilez need to go back. He's going. And where's Supi? Supi is still going. Supi is up to castle. It's just go and take the hill. This is what they need. Here, the arches killing some... I know the two villages, man. But he's still ahead. The max is still ahead to say my name. Say my name gonna be in castleage. Faster than the max. You can see. Crossbow and Botkin Arrow, it's happening. The game really close seems to be a little bit ahead vietnam because of the timing being in castle age yes exactly all my chaps a little bit faster vietnam to castle age but now the fights the micro the decision is gonna be crucial i don't know what vilez is doing really what is he doing just walking yeah this is a good job to lose the scout for nothing now he's sending knights to the other spot uh oh, still losing more villages. Now he's not five villages anymore. He lost some villages. Look at the dead bodies. And in this spot, you can see many knights and arches, future crossbows. Yes, he has many, many arches. But now Biles went away. And now he's coming. I don't know what Biles is doing. But now this can be a big damage. 40 moons! The subscription, 40 moons! What else to say? Nothing, man. 40 moons is pretty sick. 
Now he's coming with the knights. The problem is that they split. They split their units, losing two villages. There you go. Gonna lose another? No, he didn't. But the knights are coming. Those knights are plus two bloodlines. The knights are plus one, four back. The, this, he should go now. He should go now. He's coming. Let's see if he's gonna come in the same time. No, no, no. No, no, no. He's gonna kill that. One knight down. The micro is crucial here. The micro is crucial. The max ballistic. Say my name, ballistic. Huge battle all over. You can see the Kronos in the other side, but I'm gonna focus in the 2v2. 2v2. Ballistic ACCM. So they need to take the fight before they take the ballistic. Come on, what are you doing? He's waiting more and more. Well, if you wait more and more, then Supi will lose the RTD ranges. Good job! And now he's gonna take the fight and Supi is not going. Not a good teamwork there by Pelan. Definitely not. Losing another archery range. And then, what is he going to do? University. With no military buildings. I don't understand what they are doing. Now the Max is gonna stay at home, but say my name is coming to bottom. So, Vietnam, with a really important advantage. Really important advantage. Supi now without any military buildings. He's gonna lose the archery range. Come on. He's not taking. He's gonna kill now with the crossbows. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's gonna make more archery ranges or not? He's not doing. Supi is at the limit and they are still not fighting. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Good teamwork here by Vietnam. Still pu -pu 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 pushing. And Supi now with nothing. No RT range. That's crazy. Sending more and more knights. Let's see if Bilez will dominate or not. Bilez with plus one, plus two. But he, they, they keep coming with more and more army. Well, now Supi can't do anything. Siege wars up. Another RT range. The only good thing is that Hans are Hans. Three. Three versus two. The Max gonna kill Billy's too. Yes. He's killing Billy's now to say my name. Good job. He's attacking, but Gray is here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Man, man, man. Vietnam need to now fight properly or will be a big, big problem. Doing another stable. They are going all together. But then the Max gonna destroy at home to say my name. We will see. 90 population both. And many archers for ACCM and say my name into the pocket. The Max, sorry, Supi is coming. They are trying to go all together. This is a lot of knights, and the Max is still killing billies. Whoa! Killing a lot of billies. And now gonna take all the crossbows? Yes! He has a lot of archers. He has the tower, but he's gonna kill billies. One, two. How many? He's killing a lot. The tower is doing the job, but he's doing a massacre. A massacre on Say My Name, who is playing an amazing game. Really? Yes, because he's in the other spot. Now look at the huge fight he's coming. Whoa, this is now Vietnam game already? Because this fight, I don't know, man. He's losing a lot. This is a lot of knights, but look at the amount of crossbows, man. Look at the amount of crossbows. Whoa, man. They are losing a lot, but this is a lot of knights. I'm killing a lot of knights as well. And here now with the crossbows, kill advantage. Okay, they take the knights and back this in the other spot. Wow. Look at the population difference. Vietnam with a huge advantage. Now, one, two, three, four RT ranges more. Trying to get it back. 62 villages. The economy for for Finland is still better. Still better economy for Finland. And he's coming back with the hands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What a great game already. Lot of action. Lot of action. Yes, he lost good amount of units. But guys, ooh, ooh. Let's see the mango nil. The mango is crucial. The mango is crucial. Come on, what are you doing? He's going to the edge of the map with the mango nil. He's still going, man. He's searching the, the edge of the map. He's searching for Bua. Okay, let's see. I don't know. I don't know. TC taking the wood. I mean, he could make a good mangonel shot. Now he's coming to the other spot. Yeah, but he, he got two mangonels, man. He need to go there and make the damage. Anyway, let's see in the other side. Ooh, the Max is big problem. But the good thing for the Max is the civilization he got. An amazing one. An amazing six civilization Indians that let him still in the game. But now ACCM population is incredible. Oh my goodness, thank you so much for the $10, man. Thank you so much. Let's keep going with the great, great tournament and knights and cab arches. The good thing is that these civilizations are incredible. They are still with way better economy. Yeah, man, they have... No, not way better, better economy. But military numbers are huge 
advantage for Vietnam. Huge advantage for Vietnam. Really, really well played here by Vietnam. And I don't know if they are going to be able to come back. He's now trying to send all the Cavarches and the Knights. He's gonna be in time. Whoa, 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 whoa. The Max in big problems. They are moving now. He has the up. Good amount of tone center, but look at the amount of crossbows. Three players and the max 72 villains, but moving, moving all. And doing another TC. Let's see if they are going to be in time. In this spot, you need the Mangonels. He's gonna make the... Ooh, be careful. He's coming. He's coming with the Mangonels. He's gonna notice. He's gonna notice. Ay, ay, ay. Creepy Troleon. Thank you so much for the subscription. I have put lower the, the alert, guys, just to focus completing the casting. The max in huge problems. ACCM with Incas on the way to Imperial. That's huge. That's really huge. Shoot! Didn't shoot. They are taking Finland. A lot of bad fights. A lot of bad fights. Honestly, most of the fights bad, man. Most of the fights bad, man. Thank you for the subscriptions and resubscriptions. I'm focusing this one. And now back to Purple and Gray all together. They are doing an amazing job, really. Say my name on the way to Imperial while Supi is on the way to die. Yeah, on the way to die. Definitely. They are, he is on the way to die. He's against a mess of civilization. But Yellow is trying to go with many knights. So many Kalbarches. Are they are going to kill now all the, all the units? Well, let's see. If Yellow... Oh, he has beautiful resources to go up to Imperial, but guys, he didn't stonewall. No back the on the way to Imperial. All Vietnam, of course, on the way to Imperial. Awesome play. Awesome play. Yeah, man, this game is, is the equalizer, man. Is the 1-1. One, one. Is the 1-1. One, one. I don't think so. They can come back from this. Yeah, man, Supi. Supi has good population, but how to kill now? There's a lot of archers and not even up or even close to go up. And, uh, and the Max? Well, the Max, thanks to this Indian civilization, still there, with good population and some good resources. Now send the Knights to the other side. Population is not big difference because Vietnam now don't have a lot of army except purple. But guys, if it's not uh, one in here, the reading gonna be real. Let's see, man, because in this one, if they come back, the advantage, I really think, it should be even bigger than, than that score. But Finland, we have seen some crazy games from them. Let's see if they're going to come back in this one. Okay, many, many cab arches. Many, many cab arches with all the arbres. Oh, this is many cab arches. And now he's gonna raid. He's raiding the last. He's raiding the last. Ay, 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 raiding the last too. To Bhakti. Okay, look at super population now. 140. The max on the way to Imperial. That's crazy. He's on the way to Imperial. This, this Indians is incredible, really. And he's not raiding. He need to go back. He maybe need to raid Purple. ACCM Chemistry. Wow, it surprised me that he's not going... Well, no resources to go Eagles. Now, beautiful castle. Beautiful castle for both. And Bilez, if he's sending knights and make Cavaliers, remember, with Farimba, it can't change the game. We will see. Berbers need the Camel Arches. Remember... Oh, with my shot. No, no, no. The cast is going to happen. The cast is going to happen. The game is not over, man. They are fighting. They are fighting like a beast. And remember, you need the camel arches as a pocket. Back to now. What is he going to do with Berbers? Well, look at the castle. Look at the amount of army. 147 population. Look at the population. Unbelievable. Bilas doing the Cavaliers, but now, but now the problem is on the max. Look at the max score with say my name. He's Franks winning to Indians, but it's not about Franks or Indians, it's about the teamwork. They did a lot of damage. They really need to send Cab Arches to that side. And then Yellow, with many Cavaliers, try to deal with the Arbalest. But again, ACCM, like in the first game, has a lot of army. He's trying to raid with the Cab Archers. He's trying, trying to go and raid. Let's see if it's going to happen. But really, they need to all together go and save. Who? The Max. He's trying to go back. Yes, and boom at the back. If there's a good civilization that can expand his economy and recover, that's Indians. Here is two Mangonas. The castle is there. But now with with those Kavachis, what he's planning to do? Well, trying to raid. 
and yellow doing another castle. Super intense game, but really, the advantage is there. 1000 score difference, the max is in Imperial. Supi is gonna be in Imperial 2 chemistry. Look at the knights incoming, the castle fantastic, and now with those cab arches trying to raid, the castle is covering and heavy camels back. Tea. Heavy camels back. Tea. He should go back, and uh, it's really tricky what he's doing. He should probably stay at home with those cab arches. We will see. Now the cavaliers from Belez trying to help. The Max, good population. Coming with what? With crossbows. Yeah, they don't have arbalest. But if you make all the upgrades, the crossbows can be effective against crossbows without arbalest and halves. Yes. The combination. It's really important there. Now I'm gonna take down those those rams. Yes, the castle is just crucial. He should have lose it there. Now he's sending all those cab archers to the right side. But then how he's going to defend with the cavaliers. Cavalier is the castle, he need to kill the rams and just repay the castle. Repay the castle, heavy cab archers, heavy cab archers, pretty sick game. Pretty sick game, but the population belongs to Vietnam in all the matchups. There's not a single matchup that they have an advantage right now. Heavy camels and those heavy cab archers can do the job. If he repay the castle, maybe they can come back. We will see. Gebetos is coming, no. But Arbales and Caval and heavy camels, they need to kill the rams. Oh oh oh! Go and kill it! And here with the cavaliers and and crossbows, heavy camels, the max! Has to be careful with his blue. He's there, man, in the other spot. He should stay at home. Now losing this castle is really brutal. But they keep trying, man. They keep really trying. But Supi is taking some weird decisions. He was away all the time with a lot of cab arches. And now Supi. Let me check Supi point of view. He's in huge problems. A lot of arbalists. 76 army ACCM. 76 army sending now cavaliers to raid. But how they are going to deal with those all together? Cavaliers and cab arches. This is the way to go. This is the way to go. Those cavaliers with Farimba are really, really strong. If they go all together, oh my goodness. They can now kill those old cab arches and cavaliers. They need to micro perfect. Perfect. But now cavaliers inside to raid. Say my name is still 180 population. All this soup is now in some problems. But if they go, wow, look at the cast that he's doing. GG call. GG call. Whoa! Vietnam really dominated in this one. Really dominated in this one. And they wasted, like you say, Hans, Indians, and Malians. This is really, really important, man. Really, really important. 1 1. All the fights were almost during all the game belonged to Vietnam. Wow! Strong play by Vietnam. Military. Back to kill. The most in the game, Supi really, really well. Negative ratio kills, you can see with the hands. The max negative two, V less, a little bit positive, but back to And ACCM really strong. Say my name is saying uh, negative, negative ratio kills that, but in my opinion, he played amazing. He did a great boom and was way faster in PDL than the max, and uh, with the combination. They took the game. 1-1 one, one guys going for the third game. Guys, third game. This is getting so interesting, super intense. And uh, gonna see Donut, guys. Donut map. Well, let's go. This is Battle of Africa. <laughs> well, we can guess whatever. Nothing. Nobody said correct. I say Aztecs and Celts right instead of Aztecs and Celts. Instead of Spanish, they put Turks, Turk civilization, then Italian Saracens and Vikings for the other team. Pretty crazy. This is 1-1. One, one. Let me change. This is now map 3. And map 3, it's Donut. Okay. Donut, guys. Donut map. Yeah, man. And this is definitely Battle of Africa, man. Battle of Africa. Suomi versus Vietnam Legends. Who is the pocket and everything? Let me check. Let me analyze. Pocket. Bilas Kells versus Saracens. Pocket. Better Saracens as a pocket than Kells? Possible with the bloodlines. Turk Supi flank versus Italians. Italians better than, than Turks, in my opinion, 100%. But here, you can see now, Teal, the max with Aztecs. Ooh. Impossible to wall. 
Or maybe it is possible. Well, everything is possible. Well, look at this. Look at this gap. And Bhakti is laming the rhino. Bhakti, it's laming the rhino. Vietnam playing is playing is strong, man. Playing is strong. He's gonna lame it here. Let's go to to the Mike's point of view. He can see it. How he's taking the rhino and he's gonna put in the in between or not? Rhino, rhino! Are you gonna stop? No, man. Four hundred foot bye bye. 400 foot bye bye there you go man there you go not the best luring but it's 400 foot extra he took the other yeah and anyway if he puts the severas he should be fine but all right 400 foot is a plus man it's a real plus then supi with another big gap man, it's easy to, easier to wall here in front here is more complicated, but you can wall. We can see Palisade here and also the dock. It can be wall, but more complicated. And Aztecs versus Vikings? Well, both with a nice civilization, to be honest. Italians, ACCM, what is planning to do and what is his resources placement? Goal at the back, goal is stone forward. The wood? Uh, okay, remember that if he's going in, look at those. Because the forest is not compact. Just look in the middle. And you can see you can make a tower there and and dominate but we will see guys we will see uh oh he's trying to to get limit that oh that billion down billion down no kill it man it's no loom it's no loom got it he got it man it went back ay 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 Almost didn't kill it, but he took it the belly. One billion down. One billion down for Bacti. It's not like a huge, huge thing, but still. And the Rhino back. Did he explore the other one? Let me check. He didn't explore. He still didn't see it. At least he, he cannot see it there. It's now going to the TC. It seems so. Oh, well. Bacti Titanic a little. Ooh. Hmm. If the Max send it. Put the, gather the villains on the TC, maybe he could be fine. Now he's pushing the Zebras, the Mask will be fine. And uh, Supi point of view. Is it? Okay, took both Rhinos, stone at the back, Burris at the back, one is stone forward, and both goals in the same spot, but at the back, he's fine. Gonna go Trash? Is there you go, the Trash incoming. Trash incoming with Turks. And we'll probably try to go Fast Castle. It's possible. It's really possible. And transition to Janissars might be good. Now he's walling. Yeah, Bacti is doing the huge walls. And going to the max, we will analyze what the max can do. The wood is pretty far from the action. Yeah. But still, doing more and more villages. Zebra's coming. And gonna make the barrack already. Palisade, and then he will wall in front. Let's see if he's gonna explore. For now he's not doing and he's walling. They're walling like this. With the palisade and the dock. Yeah, the militia is coming. Uh-oh. Is he gonna... Oh, not letting him. Not letting him wall. Not letting him wall. Not letting him wall. Ay, ay, ay. He don't want to let him wall. And the militia... Another militia coming. Okay. <clears throat> Uh-oh. He's trapping himself. He's attacking or not. He's attacking now. Kill the villager. Kill the damn villager. Is he taking... He's, oh, this is a nice micro, beautiful one. And now he's gonna take the scout. This is nice, man. This is very nice. Really good job. Really, really good job. Gonna take the Villier. Sloppy play here by ACCM. He's gonna lose the Villier. There you go. Villier down. Just stay there. Not letting him wall. Beautiful play here by Supi. Amazing. Now he's there with the two militias. Beautiful, like I told you. And the max is the faster up. He saw the wall and he's gonna now make a tower and go in while all the others are just walling and not doing army. You can see how important he's going aggressive. Now he's walling. All right. And he's gonna wall now. With a dog too? Probably. Well, he took a bill here and now he might explore a little bit, which is always nice. Yes, he can see the wood. So the incoming tower is gonna be real, man. You can see that he's gonna make a tower. Amazing. I love this map. Yeah, I, I mean, as much as I see more and more games, I get more, more, more fun of this map, really. Because even if he's a little bit closer than all the others, 
it's not really standard. You have to make the dog, there's the, the demolition draft, also there can be holes, you can make towers. Yeah, it's, it's nice, man, it's nice. And he's coming aggressive, love it. And yellow, yellow with Kelvin Lance, he's gonna go for a fast castle. Yeah, man, 27 population. Well, say my name, it's also up 28 Saracens. We'll go monks, maybe? Three bullets on gold. It's possible to go monks and siege. Everything can happen. Now he's doing a tower. Remember that that those uh, palisades are really easy to break. And if he's doing the mana time like he's doing, yeah, there you go. He's just gonna break here. Yeah, man. To the right side. Yeah, he's gonna be in for sure. Gonna be in a stone? Probably. Yeah, I love it, man. The max playing now aggressive. Playing aggressive. Three mana times and back to using huge amount of wood. Huge amount of wood. I'm going to the max point of view. He has a stone already. Look at this. So he's gonna make more towers. Yeah, there you go. Market, man. He's going for a fast castle. Back to Yeah, man. He wants to go fast castle, which in my opinion is really really dangerous i know the tower i know the tower he's going really aggressive and it's a mistake in my opinion really going for the fast castle market and blast me in these maps it's really complicated he's doing now a tower but that tower it's it's going to happen oh he's walling back to it's walling walling everything but the tower is going to be up the tower is going to be up i i i put the village inside he's gonna make it gonna take some villages or not Oh, but the, the bullies on the tower, man. Well, did not micro properly? Still, he can break here. Just break here in this spot. Ay, ay, ay. No map for him. No double with axe. And Bilez is on the way to Castellage. Oh, he's going. Barrack is stable on, on market. I like it. And here. Oh, purple. He wallet, man. He wallet here. He opened here, he overchopped, and look at the palisade he did. Awesome. Say my name, Castellage. We last Castellage. And Supi. I'm going to Castellage, man. And ACCM. Castellage as well. Everyone going Castellage. Awesome. So, everyone. Ooh, look at another tower. Another tower. That's nice. Getting a lot of map control. Now his wall. He will make it uh, a gate. And let's see if there's some holes. But he's taking more and more map. Bakti is up to Castellage. Up to Castellage with the Vikings. But back the economy, nothing. Doing another Lambert camp. And yeah, man. I mean, destroying the Blasmid is very good. It's gonna be really, really good. He can't make Siege. They really can't break in fast. So let's see. Oh, but Viles is booming? Interesting. Viles is booming. So now the Max. It's just going to go and try to... Oh, oh, it's open! It's open! He is inside, man! He is inside on Gray! He's gonna make the damage on Gray unbelievable! Let's go to the max point of view. Do you see what is happening with the map? It's open and he can't go in! Whoa, 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 whoa! He's gonna go to the gold miners now. Awesome! But he's gonna be in Castellage and probably... Uh, he can't see it. He need to make the tower and take the goal. He take both goals. He can take both goals. Is he's doing a tower here? Oh, 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 man! But make the tower already. Oh, come on, the Max. You need to make the tower here. He's gonna make it or not? What is he doing, the Max? You need to make the tower. He's doing already. But if he's sending the knight right now, he's gonna kill the villies. Is he gonna wall those villies in? He need to wall it. If he's not walling and he's not, oh my God, the Max. The Max. Now you wall it. Oh, the Max. Titanic. Titanic. Let's see if he's gonna palisade. He's not palisading. You need to ward the damn village. You have two villages still. He's going really slow. Really, really slow. He's now doing this. Saving the... Oh, come on. That was a sloppy play by the Max. That could be really the game if he take both goals. But he lost it, man. He really lost it. Well... The Max lost a beautiful chance to make a massacre there. Really, really big damage. Now a gate incoming, and what is Turk Supi going to do? Oh, a castle, man. He's doing a castle. You can see ACCM doing a castle. I was thinking he maybe go to fast Imperial, but castle in general is crossbowman. No, he's not. He's doing a castle and. Now Supi, we wall, stone wall, because he's booming. He's not going for a fast imp. 
it's doing two tone centers and that's it then the Celts is fully booming be less of four tone centers four TCs and the Max yeah well now he's doing Knights with Saracens but I mean if he's doing a, a, a strong boom he can't compete he really can't compete against Kel's boom. Maybe the mice will go now monks. I think the mice should go monks. And some eagles maybe. Yeah. Just monks and try to, to keep this open. Disturb them. One tower here. Another tower here in the wood. And uh, he has two tone centers. So maybe teal to go aggressive. Supi booming. Yellow booming. And the mice disturbing. That's the way to go. Yeah. Another tone center. Well. Supi is going to make another. How many this is? Well, two, three these tone centers. Yeah, Pilate's gonna be in really another level with the economy because he has a huge free boom. He's the only one with a pure boom. Pure booming. And he's Kells, man. Try to stop the Kells with a boom. The Max on the way to Castle. Is he mining more gold? Three villages on gold only for. Ooh. The Max, maybe gonna make a castle? Maybe a castle at home. Another dog. And well, <laughs> okay, I like this. He's coming with a mangonel. He need to send another villager. The Max is halfway to Castle Age. Now doing yes, he's sending another villager. I mean, Stradamus is still on fire, and he's gonna make some galleys. No, he could do it, but he's not. Yeah, he's gonna be fine. I mean, he's gonna make a castle at home, or maybe monks. Can be either, either, yeah, or siege. Has three choices, guys: monks, a castle, or siege. But with this stone, I will go for a castle. It's the safer, it's the safer one, definitely. I don't know why they flare in there. Now blue, 46 villages as well. The max is a little bit behind, but really, yellow boom, yellow boom matters. Yellow boom matters. Let's see if he's gonna buy the stone. <coughs> Yeah, double monastery. A tone set. He wants to go with some economy. Supi is already doing a castle. Is Supi going up faster? This is really important. Who is going faster Imperial here? It's really, really important. Now the Max doing all the upgrades. Gold mining, Bozo, Heavy Plow, all the economy upgrades. Monks incoming. Let's go to the Max. Redemption, yeah, expected. Monks. Uh oh, uh oh. But he has to be careful. He need a barrack. I don't like that. He's not doing more. Yeah. I think he can be in trouble if the other guys. Ah, but he's, he has only three knights. Yeah, he's not a spamming knight. Monks will happen. Monks will happen. But he has now three tone centers. 39 villages. He's behind in economy. That's for sure. But the monks will, will keep it open, I believe. Mangonel, Ram, some knights, and the monks are coming. Sanity, so those monks are going to be strong, really strong. And Bhakti, it's on the way to Imperial, guys. Bhakti, it's on the way to Imperial with 66 villages. Remember the Vikings power. Vikings power, man. Vikings power. He's now coming with the mangonel. He's gonna reward again. He's gonna convert the mangonel. Ay, ay, ay. What are you doing, Bhakti? He deleted it. And he need to re-wall, really. But he will not this soon. Supi and Biles up to Imperial. That's amazing. That's really amazing. And in this spot, it's just fantastic. We'll go bombard towers or traps. Though, so he will be ahead to ACCM. The time in Imperial is really important. 54 villages. I know that he's behind in economy. But really, with one, two, those centers and Turks, that's the way to go. Because the Celts yellow well he's doing a market already going to trade but the siege and the uh, well just siege is what he need siege and helps monks are coming and when he see that back is in imperial we will see say my name going to imperial but 78 population 30 billions behind <clears throat> you think that with 30 billions behind he can stop a kelts boom if be less play properly they should dominate they should really really dominate siege wars up 
Now look at the monks. Oh, 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 he's going to convert. Oh, oh, man, he's deleting, but you need to delete the... Oh, he deleted the dog. You gotta be kidding me, man. Now he converted, he's going to convert the knights. There you go. Not doing the great job here, Pacti. Yeah, he's stable. What? Okay, what is he doing, Bacti? I think he don't know what to do now. The pocket is coming, but he's coming with what, Mr. Vilas? He has resources, he's not doing a castle. He convert one demo, demo wrath. He's doing the castle with two villages. Send more villages, man. Send more villages or you will have the castle when Jeeps I get 2k. Yeah, man, now one billion, so 3k. Ooh, Condotieros, Condotieros, ay, 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 Condotieros, 97 HP, 97 HP is a really good strategy, it's a really good strategy, Imperial Condotieros, 97 HP combination with the Vikings bonus, ay, 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 but he's converting, you need to make a dog, you really need to make a dog, be careful, he's doing Vikings Condotieros, Vikings Condotieros, well, if he get inside, he can make the damage, but the problem is the Kells, but the Kells got nothing right now. Be careful, the Max. Maybe he's overconfident, I don't know. But if he spam, let's see if he's gonna be able to spam. But he has zero upgrade for now. Those Condotieros can be strong, but he's converting absolutely everything. Bagby is getting convert everything, man. Everything, okay? We will see. He's now sending more Villiers. He need to make more monks, but guys, he's converting whole. The idea is good, the execution is terrible for now. And now, Onager's here. He can cut even if he wants. He's cutting this strategy now for Phil and he's just fantastic. Awesome play here by the Max. He converts everything. Everything. Condotiero's idea, beautiful. But Biles, heavy scorpions and the Saracens with really expensive civilization one army he's now they are now taking this they are taking this here finland playing super good and smart going with genisars in be careful don't kill the genisars but purple accm almost no army either he has galleons galleons who cares about that area now they are going inside with the bomber cannon and in this spot Total domination with the Scorpions, man. Total domination with the Scorpions. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. I thought that Bacti was going to go Arbalest and Onagers, but he surprised with Condotieros. They, he still have only plus one, and in Bacti point of view, look his score. Zero resources. He got zero resources, and now less population than the Max. Honestly, yeah. It was a good thinking, but not realistic with the situation in the game. But let's see if he can do something. The truth is that he's getting all the help by Yellow, by the last Siege Onager upgrade. Siege Onager upgrade. Genisards and Cannoneers and few Bomber Cannons. They are playing really, really good with these civilizations. Now he's spamming a little bit more, but still. Monks and Heavy Scorpions. What a, what a play here by, by Finland, really. What what a nice teamwork in this one. Now, the mice with 84 villages on the way to Imperial and the economy, the village number, the last 130 siege owners dominating and taking everything. And elite Mamelukes from, from Grey, yeah. But he's gonna be in time to do anything? Nah, he's taking all. They are taking all with the Scorpion. Look at that, wow. Pushing completely on the left. Yes, amazing job, really amazing job. And on the right side, <coughs> look at the bomber cannons and cannoneers taking everything, guys. Taking everything. Purple. Well, the population is, except with yellow, almost the same, but they are advancing all together. All together, man. Yeah, look at those. Look at those heavy scorpions, siege rams. Really. The Celt is doing only siege. Awesome. Awesome play by Belez. Well, look at his score, guys. He's just destroying. Oh my goodness! That's the shot to finish the game. What a shot he did. Amazing just that ground attack. Awesome. With the bada boom. Look at the bomber cannon, hand cannon ears. And uh, going in, man. Going in. With the bomber cannons. Yeah, man, just, just in time, man. Just in time to make the job. Unbelievable. 
And heal. Castle in front. Wow. Well, Bactis will have a huge advantage with... Well, a huge, a strong, an important advantage with the Max, but it is not there anymore. Also, Gray with the Saracens. He's doing market, but with his army. With Gray army. Oh, he's cutting here with Ornegas and Mamelukes. He's trying to make the damage. Trying to cut, but when he's cutting, he's completely over in the other side. Yeah, he's trying to cut playing his own game. Elite Mamelukes, no Celatry now doing the plus four. Uh, but in the meanwhile, they are losing all. They are really losing all. Wow. Well, Bacti is being clean. Little by little. Look at the monks. Now, more condo tiers than Bacti. No, Bacti is there with plus four, plus one. Yeah, they are, they are strong. 97 HP. But against this army, let's see. He's gonna cut. Yeah, he's cutting. Let's go and check Bill's point of view if he's gonna spot it. He's gonna spot it. Well, he doesn't have an outpost. Probably not Stone Watch. But. The push is real. Over 2,000 score difference, man. The strategy in this one for Vietnam wasn't the best. Well, well, Finland, total domination. Look at Vila's resources. Do you think he has problems with the resources? Ha! 200 population, Michi resources, basically. Michi resources, man. Ay, ay, ay. Uh oh, look at the monks and the heavy scorpions, siege, siege onagers, rams, he's gonna do the job, nah, he's, he's gonna, this is over, I mean, he's trying to cut and for sure he will cut and kill some billiards, but uh, then, well, he has nothing at home, to be honest, yeah man, he's inside, and Belez, do not notice, look at this, he do not notice, gonna make a castle or something, yeah, he's, he's now killing, he's now killing Belez, and the last still do not notice. Okay, now they flare and notice. But here, the clean is... is brutal, man. 3,000... 3,000 score difference. Look at the amount of hand cannoneers. Both are going now on Condotieros. Yeah, well, he's gonna... They're going to kill. Now doing the castle. Siege wars up. Let's see if he's gonna wall. Make another siege wars up. The barrack. Wall in a little bit. Doing another castle at the back, and yeah, he's gonna be fine. When he's doing a couple of monogers, that's it. But he has no wood. Now he has zero wood. That's a problem. That can be a problem. I believe they will sling him. In the other spot, they are just destroying, really destroying. Gray is trying to go in with the Mamelukes and kill. Uh-oh. Okay. Castle up. No wood, man. Zero wood. Zero wood. They don't resign because they have 10 in the middle, but the score difference is 4,000. Back to 80 population, purple 100 population. It's true that say my name is doing the damage and killing trade. But even if you kill all the trade, it's 3 versus 1. Yeah, it's 3, literally 3 versus 1. Look at back. To, I don't know what he did in this one, really. I was excited when I watched, when I saw the condo theater, but being realistic now and thinking about the strategy, wow. Well, you have seen the results. Okay, well, they are killing the trade. They will kill the trade, but who cares? They don't need the trade anymore. Yeah, man. And the Celts just boom and uh, they destroyed. And also, the Max did an amazing job here with the monks. And the strategy here for Turks should be fantastic. With, with two tone centers, they can need more TCs, but. Yeah, definitely. Nice job. Oh man, the Mamelukes are doing the are doing damage there. Yeah, but the Tunisians are coming. Now the TC. A couple of siege owners. But he's gonna take now everything from, from Craig. He's still 200 population. Yeah, he's doing a good job. You never can get yeah overconfident and that Lambert can I don't understand. I really don't understand. Look at those siege onagers. Uh oh, he's gonna make a, sh a good shot or not? He's gonna make a good shot or not? Ay ay ay! Now here is. They're just dominating in both flanks. They have some problems in the middle, but when they clean, and they are cleaning all, you can see how they are cleaning all. Purple is by buying the game, and orange too, but yellow is getting destroyed, to be honest. Yeah, look at Vilez, man. Unable to react. 
unable to react against the Mamelukes, man. Whoa! Yeah, he's asking here for Kutin. And he has a lot of army. He has really a lot of army, but still, he keep going. Another castle in the middle, GG call. Well, GG call, he couldn't do anything. He tried to make in the middle, but this game, Finland really, really total domination in my opinion. Really, really strong, good play. Good play by, by Suomi. And let's check the achievements, guys. Achievements, military. You can see the last, kill the most, and kill all some units at the end. Otherwise, the, the rate you kill that will be terrific, man. The max, also really positive, and Supi, fantastic strategy. ACCM couldn't make army and Bakti either. So, guys, total domination in this third. Total domination. Let's go back. Okay, guys, welcome everyone to the channel. Mongols, Malay, and Japan as well. Oh, let's see. Let's see what it's going to be. We are going to find out very soon. This is Suomi Battle of Africa Week 3 versus Vietnam Legends. Are you ready? I am. Let's go. Battle of Africa. I was right. 100%. 100% with Finland, Mongols, Malayan, Spanish, and the other team, Britons, Byzantines, and Chinese. Was right as well. So, Menstradamus. It's working. It's really, really working pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. So, I got it, man. The six civilizations in my first guess. Ay, ay, ay. Now, blue. Mongols. It's flank. Facing who? ACCM. Britons. Interesting matchup. Pocket. The Max Malai versus Chinese Bhakti. Oh, well, oh, well. On the right side. We have yellow player B less facing gray. Say my name. And you see how good it is. How good it is that they are picking the same colors during all, all the games. It's fantastic for you guys, for the viewers. It's a really great, really great rule. Really great rule for the tournament, honestly. Because we don't need even to check to say the names anymore. When you see one or two games, you get used that ACCM purple is is there facing who facing blue pliers supi yes and civilizations remember this map you start with not ec okay and usually you build always in the middle of the resources oh but this dc is not it's not the best you know i mean i would like it better here to take gold and stone i like this more you can get gold and stone the same here you see everyone is like this yeah, all the tone centers, I'm taking all, except Supi, that he's only taking gold. Imagine, for example, imagine that Purple can explore, come in aggressive, and make a tower here. Where is the stone for Supi? So that's, that's a not the best placement, okay? Yeah, it's a bad placement, for sure. Anyway, he's close to the wood, which is nice, and he's Mongols. He's probably going to go aggressive. Than, uh, or faster than anyone else thanks to the zebras remember all the food it's in the middle all zebras you see zebras 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 all zebras and you start i will put fog of war with a horse the horse really low los so you can't see too much you have to explore really good and be really careful because again the wood even if you see in the mini map that looks compact it's not there is also holes you know, it can be holes through the forest, for example. You see? Yeah. We have to be paying really, really attention, because in this game, around 7-8 minutes, we will see people, yes, players going to feudal age. So the action is going to start dramatically fast for the teams. You have to, you can see so many flaring about the Zebras, all the packs, you see, all the packs are like four zebras all the time. Not unfair. So, how many bet is it still? How many minutes? Okay, three minutes left for the betting. Okay, three minutes left for the betting. Well, 
I want to say also thank you to, to Roboboto, probably most of you know, uh, most of you know him, you know, that he's helping today with the recorded games, because today, sadly, Swiss Boy cannot be around, he got also families too, like a lot of people, and he's, he's helping today with, uh, with the recorded games for the next series, okay guys? So, just wanted to point out, thank you so much, man. A lot of people help in, in this community. Oh, thank you, man. Okay, and now let's see. The Supi Feudal Age, ACCM, be less, say my name. The is taking the goal, a stone in front, another stone, goal, third stone. Well, as I told you, 7 minutes 20 seconds, 18 population, but purple, 19. They are trying to go super fast, and I love it, because here, fast castle, it's, it's not a choice. Whoa! Archery range! Ay ay ay! That's the way to go! Archer super fast, double archery range! Now you need a house, man! He has 4 5 villages, he's gonna make a house or not? He's not doing. Then, the next village will be... Toe watch. Wanna bet? Toe watch, man. Do it. He's gonna make it or not? Oh, he didn't. Okay. But I, I, I think he should do it, man. In this one, the toe watch is. Oh, he's doing the loom. Still not even loom. Damn it. Archie range coming. He's facing who? Britons ACCM. If he's going really, really aggressive, can be beautiful. But he need, in my opinion, a spear in the middle. Quick really quick now he's gonna do what stable no rtd range as well everyone rt range no be less a scout so they choose one civilization stable and two civilizations rt range where is orange orange doing the stable back the expected in the middle oh but this is beautiful man if you get the middle it's really beautiful that you send the archer so fast because the food incoming for accm He's gonna be in big troubles, man. He's gonna be delayed, man. He's delayed. He's delayed. There you go. And now, he has one farmer at home. Well, he has another mill, but there is problems, man. And he's coming. He has a tower already. So he's forcing them to be defensive. Whoa, say my name already, Fletching. That's something strong. And Supi, let's go and focus. Wow, it's really complicated. Check the minimap, guys, because it's difficult, okay? Check the minimap. Because it's really, really difficult to follow all the action. And here, uh oh, no, 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 you need to go back. You need to go back, Mr. Vilas. Do you need a stone? He has a stone in the TC. He needs to make a tower, and with the scouts, they need to go all together. He's now doing the tower in the middle of the map just to protect the zebras. But he's coming. He's coming, man. He's coming back. He's gonna be in time. He's gonna be in time. No, 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 no. He doesn't have the fletching. That's the only good thing for him. But he's there. He's there. He's gonna... Oh, come on. Soupy. Let's see if he's gonna micro properly. He should just deny that one. No, he's doing the tower. Didn't make any damage at all. And it's a good spot here. A good spot coming with the archers, the max, trying to put all the pressure on, and now the scout as well. So he is there, avoiding his food incoming. But ooh, this is the good thing for the Chinese. Look at the amount of farmers, man. Pretty sick. Really, really sick amount of farmers already. And now, and now the spears are going bye bye. Ay, ay, ay. Where's the scout from? Well, the army is here. I'm trying to find a scout from Bacti. Bacti is coming here with two scouts. Now the archers are coming. Gonna really help. Fletching already. The match with the archers. He should hit. He's hitting. And the last. There you go. They are three together, man. Three together while Say My Name is in the other spot. Not doing any damage. That's good for Finland for sure. The score is still almost the same. And again, we can see so much damn action in this map. Amazing and really hard to follow. I get really hit days with those games. Oh, oh. You can see. Now one villain is gonna be down for the max. Yeah, and hopefully for him he's gonna be only one. Yeah, he's going back with three other villains and the arches are coming max fletching. Max fletching. Let's see how the economy is, is also going to be. The Mongols, you need the hunt. The hunt is really important. I think he will make maybe another mill. It's possible. Why not? Toe watch. 
really important. And now doing some houses. I'm checking, trying to check all the map. That micro here for the max, pretty good. Who is this? Oh my God, thank you so much, Will. We'll call you Will, okay? The Q9 is complicated for me to spell it properly. <laughs> thank you guys for the support. That really motivates to keep doing these beautiful events and hopefully more in the future. We will see, guys. We will see. But for now, yes, we keep going, man. Battle of Arca is still on fire and we will see. Oh, those arches. Supi, good amount of army. Definitely. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's going for the hunters. He's going for the hunters. No, no, no. This is bad. This is bad. He's coming. He's coming. You need to move. He needs to move. And he's going away. He's going away using time. Ay, ay, ay. Danger is gonna make a tower. You need to go. One, two, three, four. Billy is going back. The market is crucial. He's gonna lose maybe one Billy here. Or two. Yeah. Couple of Billy, it seems. Couple of Billy. Where is Blue? He's coming now from behind. Uh, no, he's gonna lose one belly here. All right. And like I told you, you can see the stone. You can see the stone. Thank you so much. Guy who says 14. <laughs> the nicknames you use, guys. Do you use nicknames? <laughs> Amazing. And now, let's see. Orange, purple together, yellow and blue. Yes. And where is gray? Army? Yeah, he's coming. He's coming. We'll borrow everyone. All Vietnam at the same time. But here, this is so much army, so much army, they're gonna trap, they're gonna trap, they're gonna trap, three military, three military from Finland, they're gonna trap, Grey is not connected today, not connected in this game, but to say, it was before, but Grey, say my name, and why VNS Cool is not playing, never, I don't know, maybe it's not the right time to ask about that, because... It's not a good game from Say My Name, but hey, he seems to be playing good, but he's not with the team, like it happened in the previous game. Ay, ay, ay! What is this? They take absolutely everything and not Biles. Biles is on the way to Castle Age, and they are going to kill, and they killed all the units. All the damn units. Now going to Byzantines. He is about to go up. Beautiful resources, 54 population, Biles only 37, but he's with the Spanish. He's expected, gonna go... Knights, yes he is, going to go Knights. And Bhakti and Say My Name both now on the way to Castle Age. So the game is not even close to be over. It's true that it seems to be ahead for Finland, but two players from Vietnam are going Castle Age. Sorry, I said Finland? Well, Suomi, Suomi, and Supi's up! Awesome! That's awesome play by Supi that he's on the way to Castle Age with Mongols. Faster than Britons. Why I say that? Well, Britons is a pretty strong civilization too. But it's true that here is no ships. No advantage for them. Well, the Mongols got all the hunt bonus. I'm gonna switch again to Supi point of view. We have now everyone on the way to Castellage. And the max that click it later. Malai, remember. Malai, 38 villages, 22 army. Alright. So... The Knight Civilizations are Biles 35, Biles 38, Bhakti, Bhakti, Castellit, Chinese, okay? Okay, let me check. One, two, three, four scouts is gonna go and take on the TC. Uh-oh, be careful, be careful. <coughs> How old is your mental age, did you think? 69. And now, let me check. Look at those arches, it's gonna go forward 63 population. Okay, bot Kinaro. And, and, be careful, man. <coughs> wow, so many archers, man. So many archers. So many archers. Wow, they're doing team walls already. Look at the walls from Blue and Teal. Look at the walls, guys, in the minimap. <laughs> no, 69 is fine. But now, focusing the game, guys, is the most important. All the other stuff is pretty cuckoo. And now. Arches and Knights, in this game, I really like how Finland is playing together during all the game. That doesn't mean that if you take a bad fight, the game can't change. Completely, it's true. But for now, they are playing close, close to perfect. Look at the amount of Arches and Crossbows. Crossbows that got going to be there. And probably ACCM, if he do not notice, he's gonna lose some villages. We will see. Now he noticed instantly. He noticed, yes. But he's taking one village down at least. Nothing else. Going to the middle, we can see yellow and teal all together on the right side. 
What? Well, another beautiful... T oh, what is this? Okay, another TC. Really good. Because they are close to each other, so... It can avoid the raiding. So many army as well for say my name. Population is still close. Yes, it is. But the max is again in another level. Oh, ACCM, what are you doing in this one? Aye, aye, aye. 36 villages. He's behind already with army and with villages. Britons, remember, snipers. Eight range. But here, so many archers. So many archers from the max. And the max and Vilas are taking in the middle absolutely everything but say my name now joining the party good job while blue wow but blue is killing everything everything to accm what are you doing man 33 villages accm so behind in economy now but military they have here good army good army going together they maybe need to, well maybe no they need really to make damage on the others yeah Orange and grey are going. Purple is supporting a little bit. Take the spear super fast. But they still have a lot of army. The Max has a lot of army. Grey has a lot too. The Knights are plus two. Plus two as well for Bakti. And also plus one. Okay. And the Max. Padded Archer Armor. Bozo. Oh, be careful. Oh, he's close to the tone centers. He need to go back a little bit. This is a lot of farming. He need to go back. What? Why he's not going? Look at that village on the TC. Yeah, he's fine. He's completely fine. I mean, they are doing some good job, but he is a fine, definitely. He need to delete perfect communication. Perfect communication. And here, yellow, three stables. One, two, three tone centers, 60 villages. The economy advantage from Finland seems to be really important. Just look at the numbers. Really, ooh, soup is coming now with so many crossbows, but they are all three together there. Now yellow is coming and this is a huge fight. All the six players fighting in the same spot, almost. You can see the knights now. Supi needs to go and attack. The mass is coming as well. Who is gonna take this fight? Is probably gonna take the game or maybe not. It depends because really they have an important advantage. You can see, but seems that Bakti is keeping alive more. Oh, but the amount of crossbows is just killing every. Everything, everything there. Wow, whoa, 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 whoa. Look at the Max army, 33 army. He got now more than double than say my name. And those crossbows are taking absolutely everything. There you go. Do you see it? Because now you don't see Vietnam army anymore. Oh, some good crossbows here trying to get inside. Remember that the multitasking is crucial. Always take the minimum like I'm doing. And he's going back a little bit. Tom watch heavy blow. Villiers difference. Let's check. Guys, Villiers, 20 Villiers more than Byzantines. The only good thing for Byzantines is that he can maybe go up to Imperial thanks to... Yes, you see guys, and I didn't... I wasn't in his point of view. He's up to Imperial because Byzantines 33% cheaper. That can be really, really dangerous. Really dangerous. Yeah. Now... Going for, for who? For Malay the Max, 110 population. 110 population. The Max ratio kills that is amazing. For Supi is also good. Bilez a little bit negative, which is normal when there is knights and all the others are with crossbows, because you get less army. But say my name, Imperial Age, now can be a game change if he play properly. The problem for him is that, yeah, his resources are at the very limit. At the very, very limit. Now Vietnam is doing more army again and uh, Supi hand card Supi is playing amazing honestly I really think that Supi according that he has been away really long time I really have the feeling that we could say that Supi is being the MVP for 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 Suomi in this tournament for now really I mean the Max is playing really strong but Supi is really playing in another level and in the in the previous week I still remember one of the games against Titans, playing him with the Saracens. If you didn't watch that game, go and watch it, you will enjoy. Right now, back in this one, we can see be led with so many knights and crossbows, they are trying to attack. But is Grey gonna be able to push? Or they will be will be able to to push it back with Arbalest? We will see. Now it's a lot of farming again for 
Yeah, for Bacti and Purple, but it's still three players here and three players against six players already. ACCM now ballistic. A little bit slow, if you ask me. Even more when you have those snipers. Really, the Max going to click up to Imperial. Beautiful castle. Beautiful and amazing castle. He's coming with a mangonel, knights and crossbows. And now the Mike's going to be an Imperial crazy 90 villages, 48 army. And yeah, man, he clicked Imperial and it's in, a, in a minute and 30 seconds. It's fantastic. It's fantastic performance here. Yeah, you can put this commission mark, this commission mark YouTube, and my channel is called Men TV. Now you can see the knights. And the Arbalest Crossbows, the castle is crucial, they need to wait a little bit. Thumbrin, Leather Archer Armor and say my name with Bresser. Yeah, or Playboy TV Arbrid, remember it can be called like this, why? Think a little bit. And now... Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I could mute it. I'm a little bit cold. But now we can see Biles, Imperial Age, Supi Imperial Age, Stone Mining. They are three plies going to be in Imperial with no, not many economy. Well, because they know they have to take some fight, but really, the Max now with that army, with that army, I'm still on his point of view. Look, his score. It's Malai! It's dangerous civilization, really, in some specific situations. But now they are trying to make the damage on Belez. They have to be careful. They really have to be careful. Bakti is still not even close to go up. No, man, he's spamming knights. Look at the Arbalest and now sending rams. They need to go. He's sending all the knights and sending now the Arbalest. But the push is starting. But ooh, this castle is crucial. This castle is just fantastic. As two tones send this covering all the resources and the castle as well. Siege so works up. Like I told you, it's a dangerous, it's, it can be a dangerous strategy for the other team, but Finland is playing so good. Now let's see those Arbalest. And uh, here, wow, the amount of army now from ACCM is really, really strong. But ACCM is not even up to Imperial. The Arbalest coming now from behind, look at this. A lot of army, man. A lot of army. Now they can take everything. And uh, if they kill all those, this might be the game, guys. This might be the game. What a what a, what a great play here in this game for, for Finland. From minute one till the 36. We will see now all those knights and the armless, man. Doing a castle in this spot. Yeah, man, the Max playing amazing. I think he listened to me. He listened to me that I say Supi is the MVP and he's, the, he's trying to say Supi, Supi, I am the Max, man. I am the Max. I'm here just to join and ready to rumble. ACCM and Bakti now up to Imperial. Where is the Knight? Ooh, he's killing all the Knights. He needs to make the castle, but the Knights should take down the... Oh, man, he's not finishing the castle. Amazing. And here now, look at this amount of crossbows. 116 population and... 35 army inside, which is gonna be complicated to stop, but Subi has now Arbales. Arbales, he deleted the castle, deleted the castle and doing the castle at the back. No, not yet. He's now trying to go back. It's difficult to stop this, difficult to stop. Vietnam keep fighting like warriors. I love it. Population is still ahead to Vietnam in all the matchups. Yes, they are, but they are fighting now so much. Yes, Finland is Sorry, Vietnam is fighting so much, but they have, remember, Biles in Imperial now with 137 population, in my opinion, playing really strong as well. And now they have the Spanish trade. They are preparing the trade and they are going to make the trade. And look at that trap. Oh, oh, he's killing all. He is killing all the archers to ACCM. Killing all. And now we'll try to go probably with the Mongols power. I don't know why those Arbalists are not a little bit forward. They need to go forward with the Cavaliers and dominate everything. Couple of Cavaliers to take down those Rams and finally he's doing say my name a castle. 132 population. The game is still not over. Do you know why? Because Vietnam still have the, the economy okay. I mean, they are not raiding. Yes, Finland for now is not raiding. The score is huge difference because look at the ratio kills dead. And, and right now, military, military numbers is way better. And be less paladins. Be less paladins. He wants to make a market here. This is a beautiful Mongol arch architecture. 
you can check all in exclamation mark mods probably you say it in the chat but i am completely focusing the games one two trebuchet and many many arbalas but he's against britons britons should be okay but the numbers matters and numbers better for supi if he's doing siege rams he won't be able to stop him with britons that's for sure say my name he's doing bombard towers why he's not doing uh halves it's a good uh, it's a good uh, point why no halves let's go and check his point of view say my name has zero wood zero foot only gold and some stone bombard towers is a good idea but why no halberdiers well they are one and all trying to go for the imperial long game they are trying but be less paladin upgrade paladin upgrade this is a beautiful spot i will make a, a wall and gate if you ask me but now Bakti, Cavaliers and Bakti will do halves. Yes, he's doing halves, so he's okay with that. And here, on the left, ACCM, 130 population and now hitting the castle. He's now Supi, starting to make... Wow, I told you, man, Siege Rams! Siege Rams, this can change... Well, it can definitely kill the game. Oh, those Knight Raiding. Is he gonna wall? Is he gonna wall the max? He's not walling the max. He's not walling the max. Ay ay ay, the max! Not walling, so back to is ready. That's not good. Paladin's coming. And here a lot of arbalas. In this spot, repairing the castle. Many traps, but he should send now the rams. His three rams, a oath to kill. A oath to kill. He has a lot of army. Look at those cavaliers going to the damn hell. And the drill! Ferraris! He's doing Ferraris already and Paladin's coming. Whoa! The score different is like this for a reason. They have good army, but now the mass is getting raided. It doesn't really matter. His, his uh, army is not super expensive. The castle is down. But now those Paladins with siege rams and arbalists and traps are taking the fight. Look at the score. It's increasing because, really, Finland is playing just really too strong. They have all the units to kill to win the game at least in this spot they going to clean absolutely everything and in the other spot he's there with Arbol oh he he break in with the arbalest man they don't have trade so it doesn't really matter it's a big difference already 20 trade card no trade siege rams ferraris and finland is getting closer and closer to win this this set man Really oh but the trade man the trade is bye bye man the trade is also bye bye for Finland ay 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 but the siege rams are just killing absolutely everything super po population is the same than ACZM even less now and back is there with cavaliers trying trying to kill to destroy the rams he's gonna be able before he's losing the castle maybe he's gonna save the castle whoa he's saving the castle in the last second 192 hp but they still pu -pu 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 push it he need to repair that one doing the castle on his face arbol is incoming and in the other spot he's still raiding guys population for vietnam is still incredibly strong just look at the population now the paladins are there man they are not resigning man this this Vietnam is just fading like warriors. Look at the population Vietnam now with 110, 20 and 30 villages. An army, more army for Vietnam. Unbelievable game, really. Whoa, really strong. It's true that they still have the trade advantage. That's really important. But now Vietnam with cheap, cheap army has a lot of army. They didn't finish this one, Arbales. Arbalest that are worse Arbalest than, than those, than the, the Britons, and you can see, well, the Palais are there, but uh, I don't know, man, I don't know, he's doing now a castle, the last, Ooh, he's gonna be, yeah, he's gonna be able to do it because he's spent his values, otherwise, look at Su, what is he doing now, why he's going ma back to Max, is the Max going to go elite Karamid warriors, maybe, he did the castle juice in time, fantastic, whoa, Okay, we will see guys, we will see because the game keep going and they are now pushing. Look at ACCM, they know that the, if they lose it's bye bye, so they are pushing it back here. This is incredible game already, wow! Yeah, many many of you, including myself, 
thought that the game was over, but they are still fighting, man. They're still fighting like crazy. Cavaliers, Hounds, Arbalest, Lombos, and all these skirmishes. Good combination here. Are they going to take down this? This is a lot of Arbalest, but those are doing a lot of damage. The traps trying to kill those and cover it. I see a lot of flaring in the other side, but Arbal is going back. Mining the goal. And what is he doing? Guys, uh, say my name is now playing insane. Look at those six rams, a lot of health, bombard cannons, trebuchet. How to stop this? Well, Teal need to stop because yellow is on the left. On the left. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at those paladins and arbalets going to the other side. Okay, let's see. The game is fantastic, just fantastic. Yeah, he's doing an amazing job on the other side. An amazing job on the other side. The population is still there. The trade, the trade might give the game to Finland if the game keeps going like this, because they are not trading yet. Yes, Vietnam is not trading. He's with the skirmish. He's doing the castle in front. He needs to repair his siege rams. Going to take absolutely everything. Amazing play by by Finland with Biles on the left, and then he switch and who is trying to defend. It's look at the max. The max god right now, guys. How many army? Yes, it's starting to make Karamid warriors. The Karamid warriors trying to kill the halves, but now you need to kill those arbalets. The arbalets are really killing the Karamid warriors. Yeah, but he can spam. Forever, forever Karami Warriors, super, super cheap, awesome, awesome game. On the left, he's still trying to push with Elite Kirmish's Arbalest and Elite Magondite already. Elite Magondite. Wow, well, in Imperial, I really think that the civilizations, the combination should be better. Should be better for Finland. If the game keeps going longer and longer, well, Mongols, Siege Honoris, Siege, uh, Siege Rams, Elite Magodites, Trebuchets, Arbalest, everything, you know? Yeah, but you can spam the Karambit Warriors forever and with the Karambit Warriors and Arbalest you stop the Byzantines. Except if Byzantines is going Elite Cataphrax. But that's not gonna happen because you need a huge economy for that. And you can see Say My Name. Well, he's starting to get some economy. Maybe he's gonna be able to do it. Let's see. On the left, we can see how they still poo 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 poo, poo pushing really strong. More siege wars up. The man's now doing blast to ends. And Palanis and siege rams trying to kill the bombard towers as well. Game beautiful to watch. Beautiful to watch. Insanely tiring to cast him because I didn't have a single break from action from minute 10. They are fighting, going to one side, to the other, also moving at the same time. The micro and the multitasking for the flies is just in another level, really good. And Arbalest and Skirmishes with the Mango that is trying to also cover now the Siege. If you take the Siege here, sorry, if you cover the hit, the Siege here, that's the game. Because now they are going to clean purple and they are, or better say, Supi is cleaning absolutely everything with the Mango that is not letting him to make that castle. And even if ACCM has 112 villages, he's gonna clean really quick. We will see if I'm wrong or not. With some Paladin support, that's the way to go. In the right side, the Siege Rams, Karamid Warriors, and Arbalest. Wow, look at the battle here. Siege Rams versus Siege Rams. A lot of Bombard Towers, beautiful castle architecture from Byzantines, a lot of army. They are still with really good population, everyone. Even Bilez that is playing an amazing game is only, only 147 population and gonna finish this castle. Why he's not doing halves? I don't know. I think ACCM should make also some halves. And uh, to be honest, against those Magondites, I know that is difficult, but maybe they need Onegers as well. From Bhakti or from himself with Britons. It's difficult? Of course it's difficult, I know. And ACCM has no resources anymore. The push is real. The score defense is 3,000 and now they are pushing here. So if they kill this area, this, this spot, and they push a little bit more here, I think they might call the GG. We will see, because they want to fight till the last second. Paladins on the left, gonna take all. They are calling the GG. I told you guys, the Nemstradamus never fail. And the GG has been called amazing series, amazing last game of this series. And in my opinion, great, great, great performance. Really great performance by who? By Suomi, that did a three win to Vietnam Legends. Beautiful play. They have two, two wins already. And we check right now the achievements. Military. 
Wow, look at Supi, those unit kills. 300 unit kills. Be less negative, but it's normal with uh, Palanis against many, many Arbolas and Hulls from Byzantines. Supi, amazing, of course. The Max 96 largest army economy, you can see the Max was already slinging the less. And they got already trade, almost 10,000, while the others zero all. I told you guys, the trade, they get, the, the longer the, ga the, ga the game gets, the more complicated it is. And uh, that was it, guys, this series. And now, now we jump into SY, SY versus LOS. Guys, stay absolutely tuned. Fantastic, guys, fantastic.